Hunting for Patterns in Nature with Miss Shower and Anna. Patterns are things that we can see that repeat over and over again. Have you ever looked for patterns in nature? They're everywhere. This is my daughter, Anna. She and I went on a hunt to see how many patterns we could find and photograph in nature in our neighborhood. There are different types of patterns in nature. Here are just a few. Symmetry is one kind of a pattern. This moth has mirror symmetry. Both of his wings look the same. These trees have a branching pattern. Stars also have a symmetry called a rotational symmetry. If I were to rotate this star one, two, three, four, or five times, it would always look the same. Stripes are another kind of pattern. This rainbow beetle has beautiful stripes on his wings. He's also symmetrical, so he has two kinds of patterns. I bet you recognize this one. This is called an Asian lady beetle, and her spots are a different kind of pattern that you often find in nature. Spirals are another pattern you often find in nature. I was really excited to find this exoskeleton from a centipede. He makes a beautiful spiral. Cracks are another kind of pattern in nature. Foresters can even identify trees just by looking at the crack pattern in the bark of a tree. Does he look familiar? That's one of the yellow-bellied sliders from the steam lab. His shell is tiled or tessellated. That means it looks kind of like the tiles on a bathroom floor. And that's another common pattern that you might find in nature. That's my pet snake, Longboy. His tummy has a tessellated or tiled pattern too. Isn't he beautiful? Did you know that bird songs have patterns too? You can actually see the pattern of a bird song by using an app called BirdNet. On the next slide, you'll see my tablet shows the app. And if you look closely, you'll see the yellow lines going up and down for the Cardinal song. So you can actually see the pattern of his song on my tablet. Take a look. See those lines, those yellow lines? I hope you enjoyed seeing some of the patterns that Anna and I found in nature in our neighborhood. And I hope you're inspired to go outside with a trusted adult to hunt for your own patterns in nature too. Thanks so much for watching.